Welcome to the top 10 biggest engines video. At number 10, the biggest car engine was built in 1911 and incorporated into the Fiat S76 codenamed the Beast of Turin. It was a racing car which had a 28 liter, 4 cylinder, 300 horsepower engine. Only two of these great cars have been produced and each engine didn't even have a starter motor so they had to be hand cranked with a special fuel mixture and detonated on a correct piston. At number 9 we look at one of the most overkilled engines which was installed in a custom Peterbilt truck. Composed of two 12 V71 Detroit engines it has a total of 8 superchargers, 12 blowers and even nitrous to give this truck a total of 3000 horsepower. Built by Mike Harris and his crazy team, this is truly a beast and not to be reckoned with and the record will probably hold for some time. At number 8, the biggest one single cylinder engine running on oil goes to the De La Vergne engine. It has a stroke of over 38 inches, 125 horsepower and 4100 foot pounds of torque. This 40 ton machine was first displayed in a world fair located in St. Louis in 1904 and then was later used for sheet metal forming. The best thing about this engine is that you can even now see it running in Roll Lake, Minnesota. At number 7, the largest piston driven aircraft engine ever built goes to the Lacoming XR7755. It had 36 cylinders, 127 liters of displacement and it had over 5,000 horsepower. Sadly, only two of these engines were built before the project was terminated in 1946, after World War II. The engines were supposed to be used in the Convair B36 which is one of the most powerful bombers for its time. At number 6, one of the biggest turbine engines goes to the General Electric GE90. It has a 135 inch diameter and over 115,000 pounds of thrust. It is currently used in the Boeing 777 variants and is still one of the most efficient wide body engines in service today. The GE90 also broke the record for being a part of one of the longest flights lasting over 22 hours from Hong Kong to London. At number 5, the most powerful and ground baking engine is the F1 rocket. It has over 1.5 million pounds of thrust with only being 19 feet high and 12 feet across. Escaping Earth's gravity is a really tough thing and requires a high amount of energy, which is why five of these engines were used on the Saturn V rockets. The Saturn rockets were a marvel of engineering and ultimately got man to space and onto the moon. At number 4, the biggest truck engine is used extensively in the mining sector. The CAT 797F series truck uses a single block, 20 cylinder engine which outputs at 4000 horsepower. The 797 is not the biggest truck but can haul over 400 tons or go 40 miles per hour. The Liebherr 284 also houses a V20 engine but it's rated at less horsepower. At number 3, the biggest train engine. Trains contain some of the biggest engines for mobile transportation in the world and the Union Pacific General Electric houses an 8500 horsepower gas turbine engine. It was only used in 1952 to 1969. Union Pacific also developed an EMD variant which had a 6600 single diesel engine used in the 1970s. At number 2, one of the biggest unknown diesel generators is actually used in a 200 megawatt plant in India. Each engine is 70,000 horsepower, 5 stories high and powers a 50 megawatt unit. Another amazing engine is the 884WS150 BMW diesel engine from 1935. It held the record for being the biggest engine for more than 30 years so it's worth checking out in my links. At number 1, the biggest and most powerful marine engine is the Wartzilla Salzer 14RT Flex 96C. It is over 40 feet high, 87 feet long and it produces over 100,000 horsepower or 5.6 million foot-pounds of torque. It is the largest reciprocating engine in the world, well at least for now. This engine is used in some of the biggest tankers in the world and over 300 of these engine variants have been sold. This engine will likely be replaced in the future by a bigger sized engine since tankers are only getting bigger and the world demand for goods are only getting stronger. So once again, thanks for watching, please like this video and subscribe to my channel.